As temperatures continue to rise, so does the risk for heat exhaustion and heat strokes. The U.S. Department of Health and Human, Resor Human Services reported more than 2,300 heat-related deaths in 2023. So that heat-related deaths have gone up every year since 2020. Those at the biggest risk are people with increased exposure or people with increased sensitivity. Though anyone can feel the effects with enough exposure, Dr. Nola Ernest says many teenagers experience heat illness at marching band and outdoor sports camps. Often your older teenagers feel too embarrassed to tell someone that they are beginning to feel dizzy or overheated. And so please encourage your children as they go out to their band and football camps that if they feel they start to feel dizzy or nauseated that they need to take a break and get in the shade. The Department of Public Health wants you to know the early signs of heat illness like increased sweating, headaches and muscle cramps.